good morning students in the previous lecture we have studied about the northern hemisphere and southern hemisphere equator divides our earth into two halves or into two spheres two hemispheres which are northern and southern and today's lecture we will study about the latitudes latitudes horizontal lines drawn on a globe or a map are called lines of latitude as you are looking on the screen on the diagram since these lines run parallel to each other they are called parallel of latitudes means the distance of different parallels of latitude is same the lines of latitude are the imaginary lines which encircle the earth all of them are parallel to the equator all places having the same value of latitude to to the north or the south of the equator lie on the same latitude for example 30 degree north latitude line joins all places situated on an angular distance of 30 degree north of the equator the equator being in the middle of the two poles of the earth is the longest line of latitude its length is equal to the circumference of the earth which is about approximate 40075.16 km now important features of latitudes as you know the lines latitudes are the imaginary lines we use these lines to locate places on the earth and they are parallel to the equator as you know equator is situated in the mid of two poles north pole and equator is situated in the mid of two poles north pole and south pole and the parallel uh, parallels of latitude are 181 in numbers equator is in the mid and situated on the on the 0 degree and towards the equator if we are moving from north pole or south pole uh, if we are moving in the northern hemisphere or in the southern hemisphere towards the poles the degrees are increasing in numbers the number of latitudes when drawn at 1 degree interval are 90 in the northern hemisphere and 90 in the southern hemisphere the latitude of the equator is on 0 degree that's why if we uh, subtotal the these numbers they become 181 in numbers and they are parallel lines means the distance of these lines uh, are always same if we measure the difference between the two latitudes that is same as you know the lines of latitude are 181 in numbers but few latitudes are very very important and they are called important lines of latitude we will study now these important lines first is equator as you know on the 0 degree as you are looking on the screen on the extreme right hand side diagram look in the mid equator is on 0 degree in the mid second important parallel is in the northern hemisphere the tropic of cancer is situated in the 23 and a half degree north the tropic of capricorn in the southern hemisphere is 23 and a half degree south and 
again in the northern hemisphere the arctic circle is 66 and a half degree north and again in the southern hemisphere the antarctic circle on 66 66 and a half degree south these are important parallel lines but few more important instructions regarding the latitudes are while writing the parallel of latitude it is essential to write letter n or s with them for Uh, letter n is written with the latitudes of the northern hemisphere and s with the latitudes of the southern hemisphere i hope all the points regarding latitudes are clear to you thank you and have a nice day